What I am always drawn to by legal aid is the passion of the attorneys. These are people who really enjoy coming here, very passionate about the work that they do. I love this place. It's got great energy. It's got wonderful people in it. It's an honor to do this work, and it's a privilege. This building was a tremendous opportunity for Atlanta Legal Aid to really educate the city. On a typical day when the receptionist looks out into the waiting room and sees who's there that showed up to say, I have a problem and I need help, that's a huge crisis in that person's life. It may be the other parent of the children isn't paying anything to help take care of those kids. I've got hungry kids and I don't know what to do. We have people who are disabled and have been disabled for years and suddenly the Social Security Administration tells them, we're gonna cut your benefits off. Anytime we get a victim of domestic violence or we see cruelty to children, those are really difficult cases. We'll have people calling in because they have an eviction case that's pending in court. We'll have people who come in because their landlord hasn't been making repairs. From, I've got a bug and rodent infestation, to I have leaks that have turned into mold, to my entire house is covered in mold. There's a lot of senior citizens who are losing their homes. They don't understand all the legal terms. They sign papers and the next thing you know, they're being foreclosed on. There's some that really tug at your heartstrings. Helping grandparents adopt their grandchildren because the mother was in jail, on drugs. It brings us together. It's like one big family. It really is. If you are wronged, you can seek redress. We have faith in that. The outcomes that we get for our clients are tremendous. When I can get a client a house, when I can get a client $20,000 in back unemployment benefits, because their case had to go all the way to the Court of Appeals. It starts off in this four-story brick building, and it ends up affecting almost every person in the state. It's like a groundswell. The goal of legal aid is to continue to get people connected to the life that everyone in America dreams of. Raising their children, sending them to school, going to work, being a valued member of society. You leave at the end of the day maybe feeling kind of tired, <laughs> but like you've made a difference for somebody.